PVL 2024 Reinforced Conference Individual Awardees Hindi silang ayunan ng valuable fans Bernadette Pons hinakot ang two major awards Welcome to the club MV Pons The sixth MVP of the Premier Cool Smashers First ever rookie of the conference award Kinestyon ng valuable fans Riza Mandapat another gold for her medal collection Good day everyone, this is Volleyball Trend in PH Ngunit bago natin yung pag-usapan ay huwag mo kalimutang mag-subscribe and click the notification bell para lagi ka-updated sa latest Pilipinas Volleyball Trends After a dramatic 2024 reinforced conference ay naihalal na nga ang mga individual awardees na siyang pinakahihintay ng mga volleyball fans Based on my observation ay halos bago ang mga nakakuha ng awards in their respective registered positions this conference. May mga unexpected at expected na awardees at dahil dyan ay hindi maiiwasan ang pagkadismaya ng fans lalo na sa Rookie of the Conference awardee na si Sharia Ancheta, a middle blocker from Zeus Coffee Thunderbells. Siya nga rin ang 13th PVL Rookie Drafty. Marami ang nadismaya patungkol dito. Maraming nagsasabi na hindi nila ito kilala at ang iba naman ay sinasabing mas deserve ni Roma Maydorwal. After all, kahit sinong rookie ay deserving para sa award na ito. But it's just Sharia Anjeta showed an exceptional performance this conference. Kinumpirma nga rin ng PVL na nag-base sila sa performance ng players from the start, which is the preliminaries hanggang sa quarterfinals. For the best outside hitters, and dito si Brooke Van Sickle and Rachel Soltones dahil, kidding aside, these two deserve this award because they played an all-around performance this conference. For best opposite hitter naman, ay from the farm fresh foxes, Trisha Tubu. Para naman sa best middle blockers ay si Majoy Baron at Des Clemente. Ito nga ang second best middle blocker award ni Majoy sa PVL. Usap-usapan nga rin ang hindi pagdalo ni Majoy sa awarding ceremony at ito nga ang unang pagkakataon na kung saan ay hindi dumalo si Majoy para i-receive ang kanyang award. At wala rin kahit sino na nag-show up for Majoy as in zero. On the other hand, this is the first award of Lourdes Clemente in her professional volleyball career. Serving din talaga siya for this award dahil kahit naging mailap sa kanila ang final four spot ay from the start ay impressive na talaga ang ipinakita nitong performance. Kudos also to coach Roger Gorayev for making and helping Des Clemente back in her peak. For the best playmaker, Jel Cayuna bagging her fourth best setter award in PVL. And for the Puto Queen, best libero, Alaysa Eroa from the Gallery Tower High Risers. For the best libero ay marami talagang deserving this conference tulad nila Kayla at Chenza, Judith Abil, Denden Lazaro, and of course Kat Arado. But Alaysa Eroa's performance this conference is just different. Kayod kalabaw siya sa depensa ng Tower High Risers kahit na hindi naging maganda ang placement nila this year. For the special award, Maria Jose Perez bagged the best foreign guest player. Sobrang daming malalakas at pasabog na imports this conference. Tulad nila Erika Staunton, Oli Akaru, Kat Bell, Marina Tushova at Elena Samuilenko ay nagawa ni MJP na i-elbow ang mga ito by her all-around performance from the start from the end of the conference making her the best foreign guest player for the PVL 2024 Reinforced Conference. For the major award sigaw ng fans, MV Pons. Indeed, MV Pons after bagging two MVP awards the conference MVP and the finals MVP. Period. No more explanation. She got what she truly deserves, making her the sixth MVP from the Creamline Cool Smashers. Presenting the newest premier team, Jel Cayuna, Brooke Van Sickle, Rachel Soltones, Majoy Baron, Des Clemente, Trisha Tubu, Alaysa Eroa, and of course, your double MVP, Bernadette Pons. So that's it for today's video mga katrending. Do not forget to subscribe and click the notification bell para lagi ka updated sa latest Pilipinas Volleyball Trends.